I bet Paul Markham away. Wave. Is there? Sean. Come on, the boys. And Lawrence, the OGs, the OGs. Can I just say one thing before you start, right? Lawrence has nicked my seat, so <laughs> I'm sat here. You can't say Lawrence because he's in my seat. That's what I want to be, yeah. Yeah. What a kill. Don't, don't be like that, Lawrence. <laughs> what do we know about Markham, Wave? I'd say, you know, because you just say right, thanks, Wave. Alright, thanks, Wave. Sean, what do we know about Markham? Uh, play at the Mazuma Stadium, I believe. Who was the manager? Derek Adams. That fucking dopey yeah. Derek. The best manager yeah. in the world. Yeah, the best manager in the world. They, Lawrence, tell him. Tell him about Derek Adams, Lawrence. Derek Adams is my hero, my, my you know, great manager. I, mean, I miss him a lot. I'd have him in today if he wins. Yeah, that's enough, Check Lawrence. Out Garland. Check out He's Garland. a total yeah. fucking failure. Check out yeah. Garland. Garland, darling. Yeah. Garlin, darling. <laughs> what are we thinking at season so far, lads? Are we happy or not? Mixed. Go on, Lawrence. Four points from the first three games. Um, but we're all tired here thinking it should be six after the Stockport game. It, it's okay at the minute. What I said to you is we need to beat win today and we need to beat Crew. That'll put us on ten after five games. I'd, I'd be very happy with that. But it has to be that if we're talking about promotion. Uh, Patterson's been revelation, then that's the main thing. Yeah. Me, yeah. Totally agree. Can't, yeah. can't say no different to that. For me, uh, that's. You know, no, 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 you crack on, mate. I'll, I'll, get, I'll get back in a bit. No, no, I don't know if you agree. I, I just, thought, just thought I'd say, I don't know if you agree, right? But going forward, we'll look a lot better than what we did last season. Yeah, that's more chances. But it's defence up like they've never fucking played a game together in their lives. Well, it's because they haven't had this job. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they the played against right, Stockport. Yeah. The thing is, playing six defenders on a football pitch, it's going to go one way or other. And at the moment, it, it hasn't gone one way or other. It's just been like a, a steady line across fucking not being good, not being bad. We haven't been great yet or we shit have, yet. We haven't been right. nice. We haven't no. Been no. Nice. That's no. the thing about having a lot of defenders on. Can you, can you see a lot of potential here or not? Yeah, I can. But I'm fine. Going, like you say, going forward, we'll look brilliant going forward. Obviously, Cookie needs a little bit more confidence. But I mean, you, you take that Colchester at home game last season when we played and we beat play a lot. We probably only had about three shots that day, didn't we? Yeah. I don't know what the statistics were after that game, but we just played them, but we had way more chances. Cook could have had two that day himself. Um, and Patterson took his goal, and uh, I don't know how to say his name because I was saying it like a dollar, but he took a good goal as well. So. I mean, oh, they, yeah. they just came off a, a decent <laughs> good game against Cardiff away. Yeah. I mean, they drew with Cardiff away, which isn't a you know, bad feat in itself. And they only scored because we gave them a goal, to be fair. Yeah, so. they weren't like the Colchester. No. We were. But I'm happy how many chances we created because last year we could have just hit a bit of very slow, and we could have probably lost that one nil or drawn one. Well, his performance at Stockport were a lot better than what it was last season, wasn't Yeah, it? we Come went on. into that game and it was a good, good game of watch, wasn't it, guys? Yeah. Um, end to end. Yeah. We had chances, we had chances. There were a lot of big chances in that game. Yeah, there were. We could have won 3 1. We could have lost 3 1. Yeah. Yeah, I totally agree. I mean, um, yeah, it's a loss to Mo uh, Crawley at the beginning of the season, a draw with Stockport and a win against Colchester. I'd have wanted six points out of that, to be fair. I think we could have beat, should have beat Crawley on paper, should have beat Colchester, which we did, and a loss at Stockport. So the main thing, sorry guys, the main thing out of that is the fact that we've only played one home game and we've won the game. Yeah. And normally, we win the away games. Yeah, so definitely. So let's, let's, you know, hope that we're getting more home wins this season. Yeah. We only need Valley Parade to be a fortress in this division. Simple as right. Yeah. We got a message from Derek Adams, Wade. He's coming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck you, Derek. Legend. Legend. <laughs> Lawrence is going to be walking off. <laughs> I do say that if uh, Mark Hughes doesn't get three points today, then... Yeah, you'll be with me singing Derek Adams, Bradford, aren't we? Yeah. Well, I'm I, I won't be singing that. I won't be singing that because it's football with shit. Down here. Giggles Wick. Giggles Wick. Go on, Get smashed. Anyway, upwards and upwards. Of the fucking chickens. Cheers. Same lineup as Tuesday night against Stockport, except for Oh you got uh, no not Oh you got you. Gilead for uh, Lewis Richards. So I think it was oddly worked for us. Right. Walker getting a little bit of injury because Tyler Smith is playing and now. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so that's made our point. Yeah, Tyler Smith 
we needed two up top and I didn't like it with Walker and Parsons were playing, they weren't working. They're the same position, aren't they? So, yeah. Tyler Smith, I, don't, I like Walker, I don't want him being injured, but it's for now, it's false choose his hand in a good way. So. What's your score prediction, Warren? Uh, I'm going to say 2-0, and I do fancy Andy Cook to get both of them. I think he'll get an header early on, and I think that, that penalty will be forgotten. Yeah, I think, I think we're going to win 1-0. I'm going to go with Alex Patterson to score again. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, and, and the thing is, if we don't win today, Mark Hughes has got to be under pressure, I'm sorry. Derek Adams against Mark Hughes said that, basically, like he's a better Chelsea. manager than him. Nah. If, if we don't get a result today, mate, he's got to go. It's the Mark versus John Cena, two of the greatest managers of all time. Oh, head God. To, head to head. But yeah, I think 1-0 uh, one of one the abandons today for me. minutes of this fucking dog shit every week. from mangoes I will match. probably get a 12 inch chicken Baltic pizza with pepperoni and donna meat on top game changer with cheesy Bosch. crust cheesy crust la bosh Lawrence what are you getting me I'm not getting anything I'm going anyway, to anyway fuck what we're doing about takeaways he's going to put and then he's going to get a fucking a Baltic that's, yeah. uh, that's why we're Bosch talking about like food yeah. because that game was, was fucking dog shit. shit. Now, Mark Hughes said that he were impressed with his first few games and that this game were just, he couldn't see it coming. We couldn't do the basics. Every person in this car could see that coming. Because we could, man. Derek Adams does football. Yeah. <laughs> Who's that, mate? Thankfully, people have finally come to the senses. Yeah. <laughs> He's a fucking knob, isn't he, really? But, yeah. I absolutely adore him. He's fucking great. <laughs> I love sitting in car with him. <laughs> it's his fault we lost because he sat in my seat. <laughs> You'll see this in an earlier video. Super Dare Adams in the Nah, what I will say is, go on, son! You fucking smashed it again. Up the Chevys. Well done, pal. He's on about Steven, by the way. Yeah, what I'm going to say is, uh, Dare Adams, Mark Hughes, get the fuck out of our club, you fucking dinosaur. Derek. I know you're watching this vlog. <laughs> you are fucking shit. You've got no tactics. You're a fucking clueless dickhead. And 
You got no fans. Yeah, you got no fucking. Eric Adams in. You got no fans in this car, mate. You fucking want some? <laughs> yeah. You're tactically inept. You fucking lost the dress oh, dressing yeah. room. Okay, Go on, Lawrence. What do you think? Got time. Time. Oh, it's got time. We've just oh, lost more. Time. <laughs> it's time. It's had a year and a half. We've just lost the mark at Bradford by the Sea. Three 0 Literally fucking three 0 Jan Sango were made to look like fucking Paul Pogba. That's because he is. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That money well done, Jake Young for scoring two. Yeah. yeah. For Swindon. And a Swiss. And a Swiss. And a Swiss. Yeah. So yeah, yet another one that's gone from uses fucking so-called shit houses. Yeah. Well done, Jake. Yeah. Well done, Jimmy Bell. And also, Aboisa scores two midweek for Grimpy. Bangs another one in again today. Well done, Aboisa. And well done, Mark Hughes. Yeah. You're a fucking legend. Yeah. Now, fuck off. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, 100%. Takes it takes fucking spineless. You're else, cunt. Sorry. Spineless. When you can't say that. Defensively, shit. No midfield. Andy Cook up front on his own. Oh, by the way, yeah, they did have Tyler Smith, but he took him off for of Matt Darby, who was a fucking just garbage. Yes. So, <laughs> I'm, I, I am not happy with that whatsoever. Matt Darby's a good player. That's, that's all I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> if you think Lawrence is a bell end, like this video. <laughs> he's 37 year old, right? Yeah, I Same age as me. I remember him. I he was, he was a good player. <laughs> I'm not going to debate the fact that he isn't a good player. He, he's alright. But you know what I mean? Come he on. don't fit in this if fucking you team. You can't get in a fucking Bradford City squad, you shit. Yeah, exactly. Because we're shit anyway. Yeah. Anyway. It's not looking good for the season, boys. Off fucking city, off because you're a bunch of wankers. Yeah. Up the fucking Chevys, come on, state and well played, son. Love you. Yeah. Enjoy your holiday. Up Mark the Hughes, yeah. Yeah, Mark Hughes, yeah. Up the fucking Tasker.